Soybeans are one of the leading products here at Pioneer. In North America, Pioneer has been the soybean brand leader since 1989, and our business has gained six points of market share over the last eight years. What a great success story. Pioneer is introducing a new generation of soybean products for 2009 growing season. I'd like to spend a few minutes today here talking about these products, what they will deliver, and the unprecedented yield gains to help meet the incredible worldwide demand for soybeans. It's clear that tight soybean supplies combined with soaring demand around the world require higher soybean yields on every acre of farmland. Our Y-series soybeans will lead the way in meeting that challenge. In the more than 1,800 on-farm comparisons, the lineup of Y-series soybeans has shown a 5% yield advantage over key competitors. That's an advantage that growers will notice. In fact, Y-series varieties some of them are actually yielding 10% better than our key competitive products. What's it mean to North American soybean growers? Let's work through an example here and it will illustrate the increased value we're bringing to the marketplace. If the average yield of leading soybean varieties is 50 bushel per acre and Y-series soybeans deliver a 5% yield increase, that's an additional 2.5 bushels per acre. When soybeans are trading around $13 per bushel, that additional two and a half bushels per acre will bring the farmer an additional $32.50 per acre. On a 500 acre farm, that would be over $16,000 in extra annual income. What does it mean to the grain traders and the U.S. soybean stocks? We're going to launch this lineup with an unprecedented volume for the 2009 soybean growing season, the largest product launch in our company's 82 year history. We estimate that these products have the potential to add 19 million bushels of soybeans to the North American production. For the 2009 growing season, our customers would be growing the Y-series varieties on up to 9 million acres out of the over 70 million acres of soybeans planted across North America. No one else in the industry is bringing this kind of soybean yield improvement to the number of products, to the number of acres that Pioneer will in the coming year. During my 27-year career here at Pioneer, this is truly the best class of new soybean products I have ever seen. We fully expect the yield advantage and large volume of Y-series soybeans will extend our industry-leading soybean position and further expand the Pioneer share of North America soybean acres in 2009. And now, here's John Soper, Senior Research Director for Soybeans here at Pioneer. Thanks, Don. At Pioneer, we take our jobs very seriously as scientists. We know that there is rising demand for our products for food and fuel uses. And I think that the Y series is going to make a step forward, a step change in yield that will help meet some of that demand. Across our research organization, we are using lots of novel techniques in biotechnology to improve plant health, to improve grain quality, and to boost yields. Underlying the success of our Y-series soybeans is a new concept called accelerated yield technology. Accelerated yield technology is a proprietary matrix of biotechnology tools and at the heart of it is our ability to select for genes that enhance yield per se. The AYT process starts with identifying the genes that enhance yield per se. And that's very challenging, but our scientists have been able to do that by analyzing the genetics of not only today's varieties, but also the ancestral varieties which gave rise to today's varieties, and looking at genes which have been passed on from generation to generation. In other words, they've been selected by the breeders. So it's these genes which are the candidates for yield enhancement, and through further testing, we've validated that a number of these genes indeed do provide enhanced yield. Utilizing this information and the molecular marker techniques, we've been able to uh, select for and design varieties that have a large number of these yield enhancing genes. Then through targeted efforts, we stack these genes into elite pioneer soybean varieties. These breakthroughs using non-transgenic biotechnology techniques allow pioneer researchers to quickly and efficiently design varieties carrying yield enhancing genes. But our work is done in more than just laboratories and research fields. The products that we develop through AYT, like, like products we've developed in the past, have, have been extensively tested 
across farms in North America. In fact, the products that we're going to release in 2009 will have been tested in more than 1,800 locations. This kind of real-world testing allows us to ensure customers that our products are, are going to perform under a wide range of environmental conditions. We're not stopping with just AYT. In fact, we have a very aggressive goal of increasing soybean yields uh, over the next 10 years by nearly 40 percent. And this will be accomplished through a combination of accelerated yield technologies, the integration and introduction of several new yield enhancing and yield protecting genes, and ultimately transgenic solutions for yield enhancement as well. In closing, the global demand for soybeans is very strong and by getting the most production out of every acre, pioneer scientists are ensuring that we meet the global demand and we do that in a sustainable way.